You like Trump? Good girl. You like Biden? All right, good evening. Got a Astron pile, uh, Pyramid power supply. Might as well be an Astron. Uh, it wasn't putting out any voltage. And uh, he had, the owner had some voltage regulators. I put them in the back of it. And, uh, so I rebuilt that back part, not the uh, not the bridge rectifier, but the voltage regulators. Put them in back out, it still wouldn't come on. So pretty much the last thing that it would be would be this IC chip here. And I uh, desorted that, and I so happened the day he was here, I couldn't find it. But I had some parts, and I found them them today looking for some transistors that I had put up. So I desorted that, this, took it out, put it in there, and uh, let's see what we got. Voltmeter. I got a light hooked up to it so I can tell either way. So and I replaced this switch here. Switching it was bad. Uh, it didn't work the other day when I turned it on. And it should work even though it ain't putting out any power because it's AC, not DC. But that didn't work. So I put another one in. And uh, so here we go. Might pop. I don't know. Oh, come on. So there we go. Supposed to be a 20 amp power supply, uh, light zone, uh, voltage zone, voltage 14.2, leave it at that. It's got an amp meter on the front, but not no voltmeter. I could add one, I guess. I'll get with him about that, but he was wanting to do strip it and put a module in it. Uh, we can do that too. If he wants, but I'd rather just go and put it in another cabinet. Uh, but either way, either way. Uh, but there you go, it's back up and working again. I don't know if he wants to keep this. Maybe so. Probably the best thing would do to do would be keep this like it is, since it's already working, and just build a whole nother power supply. But uh, instead of one module, put two in it. We, I could put two in this one. It'd be a stretch, but I could put it in here. Get really close. I need actually about another inch of room. Uh, front to back. But it could be squeezed in. But I got it back up and working. It's like he is working now. Back on. So, there you go. Back up and going. It's for Mr. Ted down there. Mr. Drag Racer. Pretty cool guy. Big old Trump supporter, too. Uh, so, let's back up and going. So there you go. It's the end of this video. Alright then, I gotta get to work on this monstrosity here. So, uh, I'm putting about an hour's worth of work on that, move it to another one probably. Peel strips gotta go in. So, alright then, later. 
All right, good evening. Got a little Galaxy TH350 in here. And I'm guessing somebody done changed the transistors out. It's got a, it's got Toshiba's in it. I don't think they came with Toshiba's in it, but then again, what do I know? They could have. It had a, uh, it had these relays in it. He wanted them replaced, and this and the resistor in the back burn it up. The resistor right here for low gear burn it up. So uh, I took took him out, put them new in. He sent him with it. And then all these caps in here, these two resistors was burned up, this one and that one. So that's them. And these caps come off of there, it was like 2,150 puff on this output. It was like 2,400, so it was 212s, so 2,400 puff on the input. So I got to playing around with that and it started coming up in wattage. So it's 1,200 here, 1,000 there. That's what it likes. Uh, I've got it to do a little bit more, but the uh, it would throw the tune off on the input. But it's uh, had to spread those coils right there. And it came down. And I put that, he wanted that. He wanted the strap put back across the pills, so put that back on there. And everything's back together besides the power wire. Uh, I don't think I'm going to change that out. Because one thing, I ain't got wire. But another thing is, uh, I need to order some wire. But the other thing is, that this thing will put out. So that's all the stuff I took out of it. Replaced. I think I went with a... I went with a 46 here and a 67 a 65 here. So... That's a thousand watt slug. Then peak right there. Power up. All right, low gear. Oh, it's about 150 and low. Medium. Oh, right at 300. But you got about a watt and a half reflect, and I can't get that out of there. But I'd run it in high. High. Oh, a little over 300 with a, about three quarters of a watt reflect. Oh, well, a watt reflect. There it is. It's up and going. I'd run it in either low or high. Ooh. Low reflex good. Medium reflex off. Ooh. But that's the way the board's built. And low uh, high. Ooh. And the preamp is working. About a three watt, three dB gain. There it is. Then feedback.
messages. <laughs> I pray to killing it. <laughs> There it is. Hope you're happy with it. Kevin, appreciate it. There you go. Back up and going. It it wasn't it was working, but like I said, I guess he thought something was wrong with it. But it's running in low I think it's low gear on that side. Running in low gear and probably driving a little too hard. And all it did was got the resistor really hot. Uh, it's best to run them in high gear. All these little amps, run them in high gear. Uh, these don't even read anything anymore just completely burn up and I had to guess what resistor goes back in there because the colors is off of it so I had to guess at it but I guess I guess pretty good alright then later